So we've come to the Outwell Robins and Easy Camp tent exhibition, showing off some of the new products that they have coming out in 2021, such as this tent that we're sitting in right now. It's the Chinook Ursa S. It's a smaller version of one that was released last year. Myself and Candy Evans have been looking around the product range and Candy's going to take you through some of the, the new products and the exciting highlights that Outwell Robins and Easy Camp have to share with us. There may be slightly fewer updates than usual for the new season, but of 49 Outwell tents, 13 are still new. Last year, OACE began a research and development project to find and fix issues under the skin of their tents. This continues, and the chances are you won't immediately spot the changes, but they should make the tents generally better all round. The sort of things you'll find include black mesh that gives a better view from inside, and larger front and rear tubes in the bigger tents to improve stability. And there's something that's taken a fair time to appear. The outer fabric over sleeping areas is generally darker now, to keep the early morning sun out of it. Looking at the tents themselves, you'll find quick and quiet doors fitted between the porch and inner living space of many tents, making nighttime exits more discreet. The Grandville 8A is an enormous pod-like tent at the top of the range, costing a little less than £2,000 and weighing more than 50 kilos. But it boasts plenty of features, like a wing lounge, panoramic front and Outwell's hook track hanging system. Perhaps a more practical design is in the Sundale 7PA, at a size that makes the most of a normal club pitch. It has new heavy-duty zips that feature in all Outwell tents, and a smart arched porch at the front. If you're travelling with a family and would like space for a washroom, the Winwood 8 has an extra inner for the living space, and it comes in at less than £800. But perhaps my favourite feature for Outwell in 2021 is the cinema screen that's designed to fit in a wing lounge. Not something for real back-to-basics campers, but I know a fair few people who enjoy it. Robins has some new technical-style family tents, including a range in technical cotton and smart fawn and olive colours. And it's also expanded the stylish Ursa range, to include the Chinook Ursa S, measuring less than 4 metres across. Easy Camp also has teepee-style tents in its 2021 range, including this Moonlight teepee in the Easy Glamping range. It's a single-skin polyester tent, but it really looks the part. It and its Moonlight Yurt sibling even come with bunting. On perhaps the more sensible side, the new Easy Camp Huntsville 400 looks like a great tent for family weekends away and should cost a shade over £200. You still won't find any caravan awnings from Oase this year, but the active range is aimed at campervan owners. I particularly like the Woodcrest, a lightweight poled driveway. It can fit on the side of a camper, but it also works as a tailgate awning. There are a fair few new accessories for 2021, with some especially interesting developments in sleeping mats and bags. The Dreamboat self-inflating mats now have non-stretch sides, so they're easier to inflate and hold their shape, while the core of the Dreamhaven mats has been redesigned so they fold up better, and the production process creates less waste. You'll also find these easy-to-use flat high-flow valves. And finally, the Mummy returns. Outwell has brought back the mummy-shaped sleeping bag. For lighter weight models, there's a new down-like fibre called Isoball, and even egg-shaped bags for those who like to sleep on their sides.